Welcome back to the channel. We're launching a brand new series called Swag My Bag, where I partnered with two companies, Tacoma Golf and Pens and Aces. We fielded thousands of applications, but only picked six people to bring here to Dallas and swag them out with new apparel, accessories, a new golf bag, and brand new golf clubs. On this first episode, we've selected Emily Taylor. Emily is a mom of three. She just recently picked up the game of golf a few years ago, but quickly became addicted like most of us have. She needs a little bit of work on her game. She's about an 18 handicap, and her bag is a little bit dispersed where she doesn't have a full set of clubs. She's really kind of pieced it together, so she is the perfect candidate. My name is Emily Taylor. I'm from the suburbs of Chicago. I'm a mom of three children, and when I saw the post for Slag My Bag, I thought I gotta do it because I could really use some new gear and was just really excited to get fitted for all this and come back strong in 2024. So first, I'm gonna head to Denver, go meet up with the crew at Pens and Aces, and get her swagged out on her apparel and her golf accessories. All right, we're joined with Nick Mertz, who's the CEO and founder of Pins and Aces. Dude, yeah. this place is incredible. Man. Yeah, thank you. Unbelievable to see where you guys have come. We started working together way back when, when we were both starting out. Yeah. Remember just one skew? One skew. Fired it up, and look at you now. You got all these different lines of accessories, apparel, golf bags. Yeah. Just really blown it up, man. Yeah, everything but shoes, clubs, and balls. Yeah. That's kind of our, uh, our focus right now. And the brand is just on par with PJ memes and my style of golf. It's just... You guys like to have fun. You got crazy designs, incredible yeah. collabs with a bunch of companies, but yeah. it's exciting to see where you guys have come. Yeah, it's been it's been a blast, and you know we're able to do everything uh, pretty much out of this location here in Arvada, Colorado. We have uh, 27 employees now working for us, so to take it from one skew to you know where it's at, that's that's probably the most rewarding thing. Yeah, when you guys are just blowing up, man, it's cool to see. Like I live in Texas, I went into a local Muni that I've never played before, but we're look, me and George were looking to get a round of golf in. We go in there and the pro shop had the ham and egg head cover and there a bunch of stuff. I was like, dude, yeah, this I'd is sick, man. Yeah. Pins and aces, right? Yeah, here. seeing it in the wild is awesome. You know, you see a random guy at the course with the pins and aces head cover or a polo on or going to a store, or a course you've never been to, seeing that is, uh, it's been really, really fun. Well, I valued our partnership and things we've been able to do together, but the reason why we're here is for this new show, Swag My Bag, which I'm really excited about. Really kind of a, a playoff of Pimp My Ride, if you will, but for golf and, you know, for me, I've just come across a lot of people that, you know, love to play golf, get out as much as they can, but it's an expensive sport. Yeah. Very expensive hobby from the apparel, all the accessories to the golf clubs, bags, you name it. Um, it adds up pretty quick and then throw on top of that your balls, your round of golf, everything, right? It adds up, yeah. We posted a video basically looking for applicants, whether they wanted to nominate themselves, whether they wanted to nominate a friend or a family member, and we got thousands of applications coming in. We went through it over the last couple of months and it was pretty cool to see a variety of people looking to nominate someone close to them or themselves, just sure. looking to swag their bag for the new upcoming season. And we're gonna start with one candidate, uh, Emily Taylor. Uh, she's a single mom out of Chicago. And she got three kids who are already into golf and she picked up golf just like everyone else did really during COVID yeah, where the sure. sport really just blew up. and. Just like most of us, just got addicted and started working her handicap down to below 20. And I think she's a good fit for both our brands where she likes to, she takes the game seriously and she wants to get better, but she doesn't take herself too seriously. On the Still wants to have fun. Likes yeah. to have fun, yeah. will have a casual drink, likes to listen to music, play with friends, even play rounds where maybe not even keeping score, just kind of enjoying your time out outside Perfect. yeah so she's uh faces the elements in chicago area obviously their golf seasons come to a close for the most part but perfect opportunity to get fleeted with some new gear yeah. and uh some new clubs and then that way she can attack the spring you know in full force yeah let's get her geared up and and ready to go for spring we got a, a great selection of products that i think would be would be great for her and like you said we definitely have the gear and the products to to make that work yeah, well, let's take a look. I want to show people around to the facility just because uh, first look at it. So let's go uh, check out the, this retail space and check out the warehouse and all cool. things pins and aces. Let's go. Let's check it out. I think we got a, a great mix of products for Emily. I'm super stoked to see her reaction of uh, what we're able to 
swagger with. Uh, we've got a lot of great polos, great accessories, a great golf bag. So I think we've got a lot of really good products that are gonna help her uh, enjoy the game a little bit more. I know she's having a great time just picking it up uh, only a couple years ago. Um, I think this is just gonna further enhance her enjoyment with the game. And Emily, I know that you love music. A lot of us love listening to music on the golf course, but sometimes it can be you know, a little bit too loud. We've got our Spade speaker that pairs perfectly with the golf bag. It sits right onto that magnetic handle attachment. So you can listen to the tunes on the course or off the course. It's magnetic, it sticks anywhere. It's a great little accessory to bring with you on the course and help you go low on your next round. At Pins and Aces, we have a wide variety of different products that kind of pay homage to different territories, different regions, different genres. And so, Emily, you being from Chicago, I think we've got a really sweet head cover uh, kind of in our back pocket that we think you're really gonna love. We have everything wrapped up here at Pins and Aces. Emily is gonna love all the gear that we put together for her from the head covers down to the apparel, some fun accessories. She's gonna be swagged out, ready for the upcoming golf season. Let's head back to Dallas, go meet up with Tim at Tacoma Golf. I'm gonna walk through everything that we have to offer there from the club side of things. Let's go. Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tim Urban. I'm the video guy for Tacoma Golf. Tacoma Golf is a golf club manufacturer. We make uh, golf clubs everything from wedges all the way now through Fairway Woods drivers. And what really sets us apart from other golf brands is that we are direct to consumer, um, but our manufacturing, how we build the clubs, uh, we use the same high quality uh, production and materials as the big name companies. We just don't charge you the same uh, big brand prices. So that's kind of what sets us apart in the industry industry is we're giving that high quality performance without that high price. All right, we're joined with Tim Urban from Tacoma Golf. Tim, what's going on, man? Not much, just excited to be here, man. Yeah, well listen, I'm very excited. We had so many people apply to be part of the show. We're grateful that Tacoma is a part of this. We're gonna be giving back to some people that we're gonna help elevate their game, get them better equipment, some really cool apparel, and some other fun stuff that we have in store as well. But I've been gaming Tacoma now for a little over a year. I love the clubs, and you guys just continue to add more and more to your guys' arsenal. You guys offer just incredible product, high technology for such a great price. I think when people really find out about it, they're like, hold up, wait, what are you talking about? That is one of the biggest things we have to overcome is people look at it, they look at the price, and they go, these can't be that good. And then now you've got people like Wesley Bryan, like yourself, and like all these creators that we work with that have the option to work with other brands, right? It's like there are, there's a lot of people in this space, but we're excited because so many people have chosen to work with us because the clubs are uh, high quality. They are what people are looking for. And Wesley Bryan is not putting them in the bag <laughs> if, if they're not gonna perform oh, like yeah. he needs them to perform. 100%. So. You know, if, if they're good enough for him, I guarantee they're good enough for me, you yeah, know? You're right. Well, hey, changing gears, let's talk about Swag My Bag. Mm -hmm. So we had thousands of applicants submit videos and tell stories about, you know, why they should be on the show. And so we ciphered through a lot of that. And we have six contestants or applicants that we chose to come be a part of the series. I'm really excited about it. I feel like we've rounded it out with a bunch of uh, great guests. Our first one, who's actually here, gonna be joining us shortly here in Dallas, her name is Emily. She's coming from Chicago. She picked up golf just a couple of years ago and caught the bug like a lot of people mm -hmm. do. So she's addicted to it. She has a, a, a sorted bag. She doesn't even have all the different clubs in her bag right now that she should be using, but she's making it work and mm -hmm. she's enjoying the game. But I'm really excited to get her in here, hit some shots, get the feel of the clubs, and give her that full range of variety in her bag so that way when she heads back into the new golf season when uh, everything thaws out in Illinois, right. she's ready to go. So yeah. how about I'll, I'll bring her in um, and let's have her hit a variety of clubs and see what feels right and get her tuned up. Sounds, Sounds good. good, let's do it. All right, let's go. Emily, how's it going? Travis, how are you? I'm great, welcome to Texas. Thank you so much. Oh, we got a lot of fun stuff in store. You ready to go? I'm so ready. All right, let's dive into it real quick. Okay. All right, so Emily, we fielded thousands of applications I saw yours that came through and I was instantly drawn to it. I was excited and I was like, hey, I think this is a really perfect fit. You have one of the most important jobs and really just crazy busy job, being a stay-at-home mom with three kids. Mm -hmm. So you don't have a lot of time for yourself, I'd imagine. And they all love to play golf, correct? Yes, they do, they love golf. And you just recently picked up the sport. Yep, that's right. All right, so during the COVID time frame, what got you into golf, what got you started? I needed something like safe, fun, challenging to like call my own. 
So, so what am I going to do? And golf was really interesting to me. I always wanted to challenge myself. So I just picked golf and ran with it. Well, you picked the right thing because <laughs> golf is challenging no matter how good you get. Yeah, yeah. You can be feeling so good about your game and walk off the course and just be so humbled and frustrated. Mm -hmm. So, well, picking up the game of golf and obviously having three kids in the sport, it's expensive. And you, you might have a bag. It sounds like your bag is assorted a variety of different clubs. Mm -hmm. And with this show, working with Tacomo and Pens and Aces, we really wanted to bring our partners together and do something great for people to where we can really elevate your bag, your equipment coming into the new season. And I'd imagine you're not gonna be playing a ton of golf in uh, Illinois over the next couple months. So we're gonna get you tuned in. So we have some fun stuff in, in store. Uh, I went out to Denver and met with the Pens and Aces crew and we picked out some really cool stuff for you. Accessories, head covers, bag, just some fun stuff. And we've got Tim uh, from Tacoma that's gonna be here with us. And we're gonna hit some balls into the TrackMan simulator and just get a feel for uh, what you like and see how it compares against your, your set that you have now and just have some fun. So you ready to do it? I'm so ready. All right, let's just dive into it. Let's go meet up with Tim real quick. Cool. All right, Tim, we've got Emily here with us. Hello, Emily. Hi, nice to meet you. Came nice to a meet long you. ways from Chicago. Yeah. She's ready to go, get dialed in. It's cold up there, yeah? Oh yeah. <laughs> Love that for you. Mm -hmm. Thanks. We've got a beautiful day here, so a nice escape to some warmer weather right now. So, well, Tim is the man. So he does all things Tacomo. He's the face of Tacomo. He's you see all the content they do. This man right here is solely responsible for producing that. He's a great golfer. There's some other people. They'll get mad at me if I don't. <laughs> there are some other people involved, but normally it's my face in there. Hey, and one thing, Tim has got an incredible and most beautiful voice. He was actually on American Idol back in the day. So. We didn't have to talk about that. Yeah. It's got nothing to do with what we're Maybe doing today. Maybe he'll serenade us with a song yeah. here momentarily. Probably so. not. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> we'll say, I'm going to step out of your guys' way, let you get to it. So we've got you set up on the track, man. We've got a full bag of Tacoma clubs over here. The purpose here is just to kind of get a feel for it and just uh, hit the variety of different models they have, kind of talk through some of the shots with Tim, and see what feels right. So, you ready to roll? I'm ready. All right, let's do it. Leave okay. you guys to it. All right, Emily, here's what we're gonna do. I got a little bit of information about your game from Travis. Now, mm -hmm. your handicap right now is about a... Like an 18-ish. Okay, 18-ish, <laughs> perfect. That's totally fine. Um, so, based on that, based on what I know of having played with a bunch of people and the information we've gotten from Tacoma, just knowing kind of what clubs people like to use and the clubs that are gonna fit them best, what I did is I kind of put together a, a bag for you to see if I can, if, if I did this the right way. See if I can put some clubs in your hand that you don't have to think too much about, you just get to hit them and hopefully they're gonna feel good um, and we're gonna see what those numbers look like. I have a bunch of other options we can try as well, but the first thing I wanna do is put the set that I have here in your hands and have you hit them and then we'll go from there. Okay, awesome. sounds good. All right, awesome. So first question I have for you though is, what is your favorite club to hit? Favorite club in the back? Of all, all of uh, all favorite clubs? Iron. Favorite, favorite iron. iron? Yeah, we'll start there. Um, does pitching wedge count? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, yeah. Pitching wedge is my okay. favorite, followed by maybe a seven. Perfect. So what I'll do, first thing I'll do is I'll put a pitching wedge in your hand, okay. and you can hit that, get used to how it feels, and then we'll go from there. Perfect. Mm -hmm. The set that I grabbed for you is the Tacoma 101 irons. They're our distance iron, they're the most forgiving, easiest to hit, and the shaft that they have in them is the KBS Max 80, so it's a lighter shaft, should be easier to swing, um, and I think it's actually gonna fit you pretty well, but we're gonna let you hit some and we'll go from there. Okay. I think yeah. you're really gonna enjoy hitting these wedges because um, they're just gonna be super easy to hit yeah. up in the air. Uh, really <laughs> way up. Yeah, way up in the air, which is, which is always fun, right? Yeah. Um, now you did say that you love your seven wood, yeah. right? So we have the brand new uh, Ignis fairway woods, mm. and I have the seven wood here and the five wood. Fun. So which one would you like to hit first, seven or five? Let's try seven. Okay, here you go. Okay. And I believe that that shaft should feel pretty comfortable. It's fairly light, so you should yeah. be able to swing that pretty quick. Um, but let me know if it does feel, um, it feels off or feels too heavy for okay. you. Let's see how this goes. Felt oh, great. That was hit really well. I can do better. I believe you. Like that's one <laughs> thing. One thing watching you swing, um, I know you can generate a lot of, a lot of speed. Uh huh. Um, you uh, and and when you connect, it's going to go a long way. So.
I love I love how you're hitting the fairway woods. I okay. think they're gonna be great. So I, I think it's a perfect bet. Love it. So last thing, last club to swing. We got the driver, Ignis driver. Okay. Um, I mean, I could tell you like the specs and all of the things, but it should be basically it's the same shaft as in the other fairway wood, so it should feel very similar when you swing it. Um, it is a 10.5. Uh, degree head and it's turned up so it's got even more loft about 12.5 um, 12.5 degrees of loft and I have in the back I actually have the 15 gram weight in the back which don't worry about it just swing away have fun <laughs> and we'll see if we need I mean, to play already, with it from, so, yeah exactly yeah. don't worry about it um, you just swing and have fun and I think I think it's gonna work out really well okay Emily, so what we ended up with is the 101 irons, which I think are really gonna fit you really well. Um, and then we have the Skyforger wedges, which you really enjoyed hitting. And I think, I actually think these were probably gonna end up being your favorite clubs. Uh, I know you said right now that it's your pitching wedge, but I think you're really gonna love these wedges. And I am very excited, because I think these Ignis fairway woods, like you, you hit them so well, and you're gonna have now, instead of just having the seven wood, which is what you have now, mm -hmm. you're gonna have a, a seven, a five, and a three wood as well. Uh, so that's really gonna help you fill out the top of the bag. So I'm pretty excited about what you ended up with today, um, but I wanted to get your thoughts. Like, um, what do you think about what your bag's gonna look like now? Well, first of all, it's going to look amazing. And I feel like look good, feel good, play good. So I'm so excited and I can't wait. Awesome. Well, I'm uh, I'm very excited for you. And I know Travis has another little surprise for you. So I will send you back over to him. So coming here and meeting Tim, he is a wealth of knowledge. Um, working with him, hitting you know, just different clubs uh, felt really, really good. So what I have now, just a couple clubs here, a couple clubs there. Didn't really know exactly, you know, what I was doing with them, but here I was able to hit them. Felt really, really good. Really, it's it's all about feel. So they felt great and they, they look really, really good. So I'm so excited to be using them now. Working with Emily was awesome. Uh, big fan of her swing. She's hasn't had lessons, um, which is crazy because she does have like a really good swing. She generates a lot of speed with her swing, which I really enjoy because I like to swing the golf club pretty fast. And there's something special about when you hit it just right and you're going all out and you catch it right out of the center. Uh, it's a pretty special feeling. So um, I've got kind of a soft spot for people who swing like that. And Emily definitely does. Um, I'm excited for her for this next year to watch where her golf game goes. Overall, I think that 18 as a handicap now, that number is going to go away soon. I think we're looking at lower numbers and in her near, near future. All right, so we went out to Denver. We got all of her gear from Pins and Aces. Emily came out to Texas. She's hit some clubs with Tim, test out some Tacoma irons, the wedges, the woods. We've got all the gear lined up. We've got her bag ready to go. So let's call Emily in, show her what we have for her, send her on back to Chicago to get ready for the next golf season. Oh my God. We've got you decked out now, so. We've got some cool stuff for you I think you'll be excited about. So let's start back here. So Pins and Aces, I've been working with these guys for several years. Great company, creating tons of American jobs, just great people. They're based out of Colorado. And so they've got you set up with a variety of things. They got their new waffle pullover, super comfy. I know it's gonna be chillier weather back home, even in the spring. Got this performance hoodie in pink. It's what I'm wearing here in black, but it's such a cool athletic fit. Hoodies are more acceptable on the golf course. We've got to swag it out your apparel. And we've got a few tops here to choose from as well. Some different styles. Pins and Aces is traditionally loud and just fun, but that's the kind of energy I think you bring to the course from what we talked about. A couple of belts. I know you said you like listening to some music, so they've got a Bluetooth speaker here that's magnetic that goes onto the cart. So <laughs> listen to some tunes, a few hats and gloves. Ball markers, and I threw in a couple of PGA memes things here too. So this is a fun game that we created. It's called PGA memes poker. It's got a bunch of uh, ball markers, a bunch of good ones, a bunch of bad ones. So you can play some fun games with your friends and maybe settle some bets. And this cool uh, snaps accessory that goes on the back of the snap on the hat, which is the ball yeah. marker. So some cool stuff there to kind of uh, bring some color and some energy to your apparel. So what do you think about it so far? 
I love it. Like I was not expecting this and the colors are beautiful. It's like, it's, it's everything I love. They got some awesome stuff. I love yeah. what they do. So you're gonna love that apparel. And then they've gone down too. We've got some head covers here for you as well. So on your Tacoma driver, we've got this nice pink puffy uh, head cover right here that matches and complements your bag. And I mean, this bag here is cool too. They just came out oh this gosh, line. Oh my gosh, it has my name on it? Got your name I on the bag. I didn't even know that. <laughs> yeah, we got your name on the bag. This thing is just amazing. It's got so many different compartments, everything that you need. Got your Flamingo head cover for your three wood. Wanted to pay homage to your, your home city, so we got the Chicago dog. And this that. is something that I'm actually not giving to other people that we've picked, but I'm actually gonna give you this Odyssey putter. Oh my God. So you've got a new putter that we're gonna put in your bag. Thank you so much. So we'll throw the head cover on there and you'll be ready to rock. And so you got your 101 uh, irons that you were hitting with Tim. Yeah. So you're ready to go, your wedges. And then we'll have a different, uh, the seven wood and the five wood in here as well. So you're gonna be decked out. You've got every club in the bag that you could possibly need now. So I know you're missing a few of them now. Yeah, But no anymore. excuses anymore, right? <laughs> yeah. So you're all set. What do you think so far? Is this, uh, think you're ready to go for the next golf season? I am so ready. Like 2024 is going to be my year. <laughs> all right, I can't love to hear that. There's a few other things I wanted to throw in for you, okay? So I run a bunch of charity events throughout the year called the PJ Memes Challenge. Mm -hmm. So typically we do about four, and they're throughout the country, throughout the year. And so I want to give you an opportunity to bring a guest and come to one of them by your, of your choice. And we'll take care of your airfare and the lodging. And so you can come out and experience what the PJ Means Challenge is all about. And I want to see you rocking all this apparel, bring the clubs, and just have fun. So it's all about just having fun. We raise a lot of money for Children's Hospital, yeah. and it's a good cause. So we're having a little bit of fun, but we're doing it for a good, good reason. So I want you to be a part of that. I would love to. And the last thing, which is really cool, is another company that I've partnered with that I love to death. They have such amazing technology, but they're, they're just really shaping the game of golf. It's called Golf Live. Mm -hmm. They have virtual lessons that they do through hundreds of PGA professionals throughout the world. And we're gonna give you access to a dedicated coach for an entire year. A year? Yes. Okay. So you have absolutely no excuses now. No excuse. So, so 2024 is going to be my yeah, year. So you download the app, Create an account okay. and you'll have coaches available to you to where you can just jump on and through video calls and set it up to where you're, you're going through your game, whether it's wedges, irons, you know, grip, you name it. You can go through everything you need to. It logs all of your history and your commentary back and forth and basically your takeaways. And you're going to be able to really just really dive in and work on your game, even in the winter. So over the next couple months when it's cold, you can set up a camera and do some swings inside your house or in the garage, whatever, and they can help you through your swings. So that way when you get out there in the spring, you're ready to rock and roll. So you've got all the gear, you got the apparel, you got the speaker, have fun. I mean, really, 2024 is gonna be your year. Yeah. I can't wait to see how your game progresses. Thanks so, so much, Travis. Yeah, no, absolutely. I'm, I'm happy that you could be a part of this and can't wait to see what uh, becomes of this. Thanks so, for having yeah, me. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> when everything came together from the accessories, the apparel, the golf bag, I mean, that bubblegum pink is awesome. With the head covers, I think it complements it very well. She seemed very excited about everything. I can't wait for her to hit the course in the upcoming season. Believe me, she's gonna be loud and proud on the course. She's gonna be standing out with that apparel. And just huge thank you to Tacomo, Pins and Aces, and Golf Live throwing in the subscription for a virtual coach for the next year. I mean, she's got absolutely no excuses. She's gonna be improving in her game, and she's gonna be doing it in style. Thank you so much to Tacoma Golf and Pins and Aces. I am looking forward to 2024 and this is going to be a good one.